Hello, hello, beauties. Hope everyone is doing well. I don't even know how to start this video. It's been so long and I've been away for a while, as you can tell. But I have a really good reason to be away. Of course, as you can already tell from the title, I am currently pregnant. And at the beginning first trimester of my pregnancy, I was a little bit a little iffy, a little bit tired. So I've just been relaxing and taking it easy. But now that I'm into my second trimester, I am five months pregnant as of today. So we have a little baby bump here, as you can see. Basically today, I wanted to talk about some of the shoes that I've been loving while I've been pregnant. And of course, since I've been pregnant, I've not been wearing any heels at all. I've been very extra careful. And uh, to be honest, some days I'm just so tired and lazy that I just don't want to dress up or do anything except for lounging around and be lazy. So of course, I know how important it is to relax and take it easy to get a lot of rest when I'm pregnant. So that is what I've been doing. So yes, the first pair of shoes that I've been loving since I've been pregnant is these shoes right here. They are from Allied and I love this color tone. I love the style of these. They're super, super cute. This is what they look like. I like the pointy toe and of course this little V shape in the front of the toe. It just makes these shoes so elegant and super, super easy to style, especially on days when I don't want to look put together, but they somehow make my outfit just look put together in general when I just throw these on, especially when I'm wearing monochrome or just a basic white tee with some jeans. I really like them. The leather on them is super soft, very luxurious, and I love the shape. Like I said, the silhouette is really nice. It elongates my legs. Besides the fact that these shoes has a really nice silhouette to them, they have really nice cushioning system as well. So on the instep in here, it has a cushion. It cushioned my feet so I don't feel any pain at all. And then in the back of the heel, there's also some cushion as well as the ball of the feet in the front here. The back of these shoes are really nicely designed. I love that it has the leather part here. And then in the middle, it has a rubber part which can help you with stability. And also to grip onto those uh, slippery surfaces or uh, during the weather where it's kind of rainy and it's slippery, you always will feel a little bit more secure when you have a little bit of a rubber grip there. And also in the back of the heel, it has a rubber grip on the back of the heel as well to provide us with stability so that you feel secure and comfortable whenever you're out and about in all kinds of terrains. So I really like these, they're nicely made. I mentioned that they're all leather, they're 100% calf leather, super, super smooth, and I just love the feel of them, love the silhouette, like I said. And also I noticed that these though, for sizing, or I'm pretty sure it's because I'm pregnant, that my feet has swollen or has gotten a little bit bigger. And so I had to go up half a size in these. I'm usually a 38 in their sizing, but uh, I feel like these maybe go up half a size just to make sure that you have a little bit more room. Uh, the toe box is pretty comfortable, but because of the pointed silhouette, I feel like you have to give it a little bit more extra room so that your feet, when you're walking, if it swells during the time that you're walking or spending uh, some hours out shopping or running errands, then you can kind of have that room to grow into the shoe and it won't be too constricting or too uncomfortable as the time goes throughout the day. So that is my thoughts on these Ally shoes. I think they're super, super cute, very affordable, tie the outfit together, makes everything look so nice and put together. So the next two pair of shoes are the same design. They're just in two different leather materials. So let's talk a little bit more about them. The first one I have here is pink beige and they're like ballet flats. I think they're super, super cute. The beige here is in the soft Nappa leather and I really like how supple the leather is. It's super, super nice on the feet. And I got these actually a while back, probably a couple months now in PR. And I just have not had the chance to talk about it, but I've been wearing it nonstop. It's so, so comfortable, especially because the toe is rounder. So it gives me a little bit more room to move. So let's talk a little bit more specs about them. These are smooth leather. They are this ballet simple design. 
it is like this in the back of the shoe it has a nice gripping panel here to help you with stability and then in the inside of the shoe it is lined with sheep skin or sheep leather and so it's super super smooth to the feet as well and then the thing that i love really really love about these is the insoles has eight millimeter of foam so it provides a really nice comfort all day for you to walk and for you to feel comfortable when you are wearing them so these are super super cute and i really like the color on them i think they're fun and they're so comfortable to wear and then the next color is just in suede it is the red color it's a nice vibrant red color it's really nice to have in a wardrobe just to kind of break up the monogamous of a dull outfit it just give it a kick of color which i really like and this red is not super super red it's more like an orangey red so i feel like it's a nice summer red as well to wear it's in the suede leather which is super soft so if i were to have a choice between smooth leather versus suede i always tend to move towards the suede because I feel like suede is a lot more softer and a lot more comfortable on the feet even though it gets dirty a little bit easier than the smooth leather however I hand down love suede I feel like suede is it the epiphany of comfort <laughs> in shoes so same style as the other one same gripping uh, stability uh, system in the back of the shoe and then same eight millimeter foam on the inside of the footbed to help keep you comfortable all day okay so the next two pair of shoes are the same style as well just in different colors and when i love something i like to have different colors in the style that i love so i tend to buy more than one color and that goes the same for these as well these are going to be loafers and they're from coach it is the Haley loafers and I think these are magnificent. They're so, so adorable, very classic, really easy to dress up and down. And I just think that they're very comfortable. I think they fit really nice. Um, I do have to say though, they, they do run a little bit wider than what I would like. So when I wore these, I felt like there was a little bit of gap in the shoe however i still like them um, if i were to go down a size or half a size i feel like it would be a lot tighter and the length would not fit as nicely as it is on this one so of course i have to get black because black is classic and when you look at these definitely reminds you of the famous gucci loafers but the gucci loafers are so extensive and i just couldn't bite the bullet to buy the gucci loafers because i wasn't sure i'm not a loafer girl so I wasn't sure if the style was going to be something that I would adhere to or get a lot of use out of. So I wanted to go with these first just to see, get a feel on how I like the style or the shoe. And I ended up loving it, but since I already have these, I'm not sure if I would going to get the Gucci loafers at the end anyway. So I'll just wear these for the time being. <laughs> Anywho, so these are just the classic black color and then it has the brown lining on the inside. It has a simple buckle here that goes across in a gold tone. And then it's kind of slightly not pointed but a little bit taper at the end of the shoe in the front here and then on the back of the shoe it just looks like this it has this portion where the leather the leather is very soft on these so you can push this down if you want to and just slip your feet into the shoe it goes down and then it becomes kind of like a meal where you put your feet through all right, so that's what it looks like in the front and the back. And then at the bottom, it's just all leather and has the rubber heel as well there. On the inside, it's lined in leather, super, super soft. So yeah, this is the first pair of Haley loafer that I got. And then I love them so much, I decided to get the white pair as well. So these are the cream color. They're ivory, they're not super white. I'm not sure if they're coming 
across on the screen as white but they are ivory color which I really like and they have the same style it's the same uh, Haley loafer the buckle here in the front and the gold tone and then the brown lining on the inside which is leather there same silhouette at the bottom it is leather and then it has the rubber sole right there and then super soft lining leather on the inside I got both of these in a size seven and a half and they fit me quite well. So those are the two pair of loafers that I have that I've been loving since I've been pregnant and definitely would recommend it to you guys. So the next pair of shoes I have here are the Veja Recife and these are the ones that have the triple little Velcro snaps on the front here and I have been loving these ever since I got them. I love that they're in this white color with just the black V and the black uh, pattern in the back here as well. And then of course down here is just like a ivory tone sole. And I really like the combination of this and just how simple and easy it is to pair with dresses, with pants, with anything just about skirts and shorts and biker shorts and etc. I think it goes with everything. It's such a nicely made shoe. Sustainable is the way to go. Definitely appreciate the chrome free leather material that they have. Here is super smooth and super easy to wear. The style is very classic but they're so so comfortable. That's the key. The key is to be comfortable and the sole is very nice, very soft. And then of course on the back of the shoe it looks like this. A lot of people say that the tongue here bother them when they wear them but I for me it didn't bother me that much maybe because my socks when I wear them they go all the way up here so I feel like the tongue doesn't rub on my feet as much. It's not that uncomfortable for me that worked out fine. So yes, these are my Veja sneakers that I just recently got and I've been loving, loving them. I feel like they pair so well with any outfits and they just give it a little bit of an extra ooh, put together and just easy to wear feel. So yes guys, those are all the shoes that I've been loving this season as I wear them for the spring and the summer. Of course now that we're going in deeper into the summer and I'm starting to get a lot of heat sweat because my hormones are raging at the moment. So I'm going to do another video hopefully soon where I'm going to show you all the flats that I've been loving uh, going into the deeper summer, the hotter heat and I'm going to change them out for that. So thank you so much for tuning in guys. That's all I have for you today. If you have any questions for me, link it down below and I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. See you in the next video, okay? Bye!